What's going on YouTube and welcome back to another episode of What the Duck Auto. Air compressor, still running. Uh, but today I have some Volkswagen content for you that's not mine. And uh, I'm going to show you what I'm doing. And you all already know, so you probably searched for this video. Actually, let me let this car down just a little bit lower on this wreck. Let me go down just a little bit more. So it is a Mark 7 GTI. I'm not sure what year it is. I think it's like a 15 or a 16. Um, customer wants a brake fluid flush. And it will not open. Um, and so if you look, let me get my light situated so y'all can see it. So you can see the cable. And you see when I pull it, it's all that slack in there. Something's wrong with the actual hood latch. And we're trying to get the hood open. So, I'm showing you how to do it. It's kind of tedious, kind of annoying, but it works. I'm not going to show you me doing the whole thing because it's going to take me a while. But I'll show you what I'm doing and what you're going to need. So, you're going to need a very thin wrench. Alexa, stop. There's a set of these VIM Ultra Thins. <laughs> They're basically like Ikea wrenches, um, but if you see the thickness difference between those Huskies or these Silver Eagles, you know, it's, it's incredibly thin. Come back over here. Let me raise it up some more. Basically, oh, there we go. There's that one. You're going to unscrew them and take the latch, disconnect the latch off the hood. And it's going to take you forever, but if your latch is broken or if you forgot to hook the latch back up or, you know, whatever it is, it'll work. So I'm going to go ahead and cut the video here and uh, I'll put some pictures in and then I'll follow back up whenever I got it done. It's also kind of beneficial to have someone help you with a screwdriver or a pry bar. Don't pry too hard, but you can get a lot more space if you have someone prying down on that grill. See, I'm able to actually get a long throw of that to unscrew. that screw it's really hard to see on camera anyway so this is what you're left with we've unbolted it from the hood our hood is now open Let's go ahead and fish these screws out. All right. Let's see, I need some needle nose. I got some. Put those there. Get some light on the subject. Now all we gotta do is figure out what makes what move. We're able to get this out, found the issue. The, the cup that this ball sits in, when you pull, it's broke. So all I did was open this up because you could hear it, pulled this back with some pliers and got that out. So now we'll put this back in there and be. Thank you for watching. I know it was kind of not uh, that much footage showing me what I did, 
but you can definitely do it. It's not that bad. It took me about 10 minutes. We got the hood open. I don't think the customer wants to do a latch, so if he wants to do it again, we got to do this again. Thanks, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. Peace.